Here's how to get unlimited and free SEO leads for your agency. We used to do this back in the day and it was quite effective. Um, it's a predictable, scalable process and if you stick around until the end, I'm going to show you exactly how to scale it. I'm going to give you everything you need so you can do it yourself. Um, so let's get started. First of all, you're just going to go to indeed.com and you're going to go to the search and you're going to type in SEO or video or content or whatever it is your agency sells, link building um, or all of those, whatever it might be. And then you're going to type in, it can either be the country or the state or the town, city. It depends what kind of agency you are. You might want to go click just remote. Um, but generally, I like to do it locally. Um, there seems to be a bit of a higher conversion rate because, you know, you can go and see them. You can, there's a bit more familiarity. Um, you know, you can say we, we're just down the road and we're, uh, you know, we're good guys. Come and see us. So when you search for this, um, you'll be uh, presented with a load of companies that are actually looking for SEOs in this example. Um, so all these companies are looking for SEOs. So they're looking for in-house. They're looking to employ someone. But this does mean they're in the market for SEO work. It means they're in the market to get it done one way or another. They've just decided at some point, right, we need someone in-house. But it's your job to convince them that actually it'll be far more easier for them to hire an agency. No need for hiring. No need for messing around with staff, increasing overheads. They can plug in your team and they get a real seamless solution. Um, this is something you need to convince them with in your pitch. So as you can see, Uber are looking for a staff SEO, whatever a staff SEO is. Uh, Dow Jones are looking for a, an SEO editor. Botify are looking for an SEO consultant. City are looking for a VP of search engine optimization. Uh, Dow Jones are looking for lots of SEO, SEO people there for their team. Um, Warner Brothers are looking for a senior product manager, Revlon. So, as you can see, Bloomingdale's here looking for a site merchandising assistant. Uh, so that, isn't it? Uh, Columbia University, digital communications officer. So some of these will, won't will be direct SEO, but they'll have SEO within the job description. So they're still, they're still leads uh, of a kind. So um, the task is now to find whoever, whoever the decision maker is at these companies and present them with a pitch. So you can say, look, we know you're looking for an in-house SEO. We can provide you SEO services until you find the right person. We can provide you with a one-off productized, you know, audit and then your content and link solution or content marketing solution, whatever it might be. Um, you can just pitch them something that resonates with the job offer they've got and you need to make it sound easy um, for them to hire you instead of, uh, you know, hiring a, a full-time person in-house. Look at the uh, the salary for these US jobs, by the way. It's crazy. Um, yeah, if you're an SEO, move to move to US. Um, anyway, so what I did a few months back, I was actually going to offer this as a service, um, you know, like an SEO leads service. So I got a VA to go and search all the job sites and then fill out this air table with all the job titles, the company, the industry, um, the phone number of the of the decision maker, exactly what the company are looking for. So whether it's SEO content or link building, SaaS, um, the budget they've got. So budget is is pretty much what they're going to offer the the uh, employee. So that gives you an idea of what they're willing to spend on, you know, to get this solved. Because it doesn't matter to the company whether they hire someone in house or whether they hire an agency really at the end of the day if the job's being solved, if the job's being done and um, they're getting ROI from it or they're getting the whatever it is they're looking for done. Um, so then I got the VA to go and find the LinkedIn 
of the head of marketing in that company because the head of marketing is probably going to be the decision maker on this role. They might sit above the SEO um, and also get the email address if possible. And yeah, there's a link to the job there as well. And this table was, was easily sortable and, and we could do, um, but basically whoever, whoever got this, this could do a mass email or they could filter by SEO or filter by link building, filter by content and do a, an email saying, you know, we can see that you're looking for, looking to fill a role of SEO, but you know, why not hire an agency? It's quicker, it's easier. We can do it probably cheaper. You know, so there's there's many factors you could you could angle your pitch at. Um, so really, to do this, you need to do it at scale because even though it works, you need to email a lot because a lot of these are just going to these are just.